Hey guys, it's Taste Pink. Welcome back to my channel. And if you haven't done so already, why haven't you subscribed? Okay, and if you are someone who's nosy like me or you just really love to see what other people carry in their purse, girl, I know the feeling. So definitely give this video a thumbs up because I have some goodies for you guys because I wanted to do a what's in my purse, but I also wanted to talk about some of my traveling tips as far as you know Im the improved experience while you're traveling so you can still enjoy yourself and have fun and as well as a few safety tips because I'm doing a little bit more traveling not too too much I went to Antigua in June and I just got back from Vegas literally a few days ago and it was so much fun out there like I see how y'all get down out there Vegas yes okay and I want to go to Montreal I think at the end of July or early August I'm not quite certain and I just wanted to say to anyone who wants to travel who wants to see the world in which they live and they want to immerse themselves in a different culture make new opportunities as well as create memories this is the time to do it and you can still do it all while being budget conscious and just monitoring your finances so I'm 25 now I definitely am thinking differently and I encourage you guys you all can do it it's possible and if you want to learn more about how I travel and you're interested definitely let me know in the comment section below so okay Teddy Blake, New York. I know you've heard of them. They are an amazing brand. It's like luxury for less. And I commend any brand that creates new designs, innovates any type of industry. And this one is specifically the handbag industry. And they're making super chic styles affordable for the everyday young woman. It's not every day that you want to drop 10 racks on a bag. I'm sorry, maybe. I mean, I'm not the one right now and that's fine, but if I can find something that's within a reasonable price range between 300 to 500, I think that is perfectly okay. And so when they sent over the Rachel Badalato 12 inch gold camel leather, I fell in love. Now, I knew that when I went to Vegas, I was gonna take this bag. I didn't know how I was gonna fit everything into it, but girl, magically I did, okay? I did. And of the first things in my bag, I have to say that my phone is the most important thing. Now, before you guys drag me, I just have to say that I destroyed three phone chargers. They are currently express shipping a phone charger to me right now. I can't even turn it on. No screen. Hashtag no phone. And I'm more in touch with nature now. Just kidding. Just kidding. Okay, so. I wanted to show you guys this USB mini fan. Now, typically when I plug it into my phone, it just starts going. This was perfect for Vegas. If you're going somewhere it's super humid, super hot, higher temperatures, I definitely recommend this. I'm sure it's on like eBay or Amazon somewhere. Just search like mini fan USB. This has a lot of power. I mean, despite me having to like jump start it with my finger, it has a lot of power. Be careful if you wear wigs like I do because I'm currently wearing one of my wigs. If you want to know the details, check the description box. But this actually got caught in my wig and it was, it was not a good scene. So you want to be careful about that one. Okay. And the next thing is a sweater. Like I said, I like to be cute when I go to the airport because typically once I touch down, wherever my destination is, I'm going crazy. We're going out. And it was important for me to have a cute cardigan, something that was, you know, very wearable, very functional, and it provided the warmth that I needed, but I still wanted to look cute. Like, that's just me. And I purchased this cardigan from love culture i believe it has the crochet knitting so it's you know has nice designs all throughout and super thick good quality material so definitely go check them out now you got to have your passport and your boarding pass i like to take my passport because that's like one of the top forms of identification i still get questions because i look very different from my photos so i'm just like <laughs> but definitely take your passport and your boarding pass. Now you have several options. You can just print it once you check in, but I like to check in 24 hours ahead of time. And I also like to either print my boarding pass at home or download 
the mobile app for either your airline. So you can, I have United on my phone, I have JetBlue, and you can have your mobile boarding pass. So you're saving trees. That is, so that's eco-friendly, that's a good step. And it just keeps you prepared because I can run behind schedule. I'm typically always late. And so doing things ahead of time definitely helps my cause and I stay on track. All right, so the wristlet. I love to take wristlets with me. I feel like this is the best way to do it. Clutch, I mean, they're good, but I like something that can really stay connected to my hand. I feel like for young ladies, that's super important because we're gonna have to carry things, ID, lip gloss, your phone. This wristlet fits my entire phone. It has great compartments. And one of the cards that I wanted to show you guys was my American Express gift card, which is a great option for those who want to have access to money but don't wanna carry cash. This is a great way to stay safe, not have tons of wads of money on you you in your pockets or in your wallet bag whatever definitely safer so next up I have this organza bag and it holds all of my jewelry my statement pieces things that I want to keep on hand just in case I need to do a quick change but this is easily accessible and TSA if they have any problems they can just easily look at it and trust me it helps you avoid hassle and plus it's cute I get so many questions about my sunglasses from when I did my epic Evelyn wig lookbook. You guys went crazy. I don't spend more than $5 on sunglasses. I, I can break them in like a second. So I buy mine from Chinatown for no more than like $8, as little as $5. That's perfect for the summertime. Vegas was definitely a place where I needed all different types of sunglasses and people make fun of me i mean get your laughs out but i love word searches because on the plane you i like to do something where i'm not playing like a mindless game for hours and hours and i had a longer flight so this just helps me keep my mind stimulated it's more active and okay when you travel there are germs everywhere i don't really shake people's hands i wipe everything down i need my clorox wipes i need my emergency and i need my ibuprofen just in case now i like to wear sandals because i like i said i want to be cute so if i have to take off my sandals which i do i like to slip on my socks easily and i can just walk right on through tsa and i don't feel dirty or grimy if you don't want to take uber or lyft or you're not getting a ride definitely take your metro cars for the li double r and the subway and many people don't think about this, but this lock is perfect for your carry-on luggage and even bags that you check in because if you leave your room, you wanna make sure all your luggage is secured while you're gone. Again, I know I said I'm an aspiring minimalist. I'm really trying to get there, I'm struggling, but this is my makeup bag and it has all of my must-haves, my essentials, blotting papers because I get super oily on my flights, lipsticks, lip glosses, makeup sponges, and a bit of setting spray just, you know, just to keep it cute. And I have my random essentials, literally hand lotion, headphones, pens, combs, even a hair clip, a hair tie, gum, I keep it all. I don't know what I'm gonna need, so it's best to have everything. And that's all for what's in my bag, so let's jump into the details of the Teddy Blake Rachel Batalano bag. The compartments on the side, the suede, you can definitely enlarge the size of your bag or you can keep it more compact by zipping up the sides. And I really, really love this for travel. It's easy to stow underneath the seat when you're flying and it's super, super, super cute. I love it and I'm definitely gonna have some links below for you guys to check out. Teddy Blake.